Let's go. Winner scored his best of three. I'm gonna get rid of this player cam real quick. Sorry about that. Boop and a boop. There we go. Sign off with a quick up air to up beat combo, but Charlie now swinging back. Quick up air to forward air of his own. Forward air into the bounce of fist, trying to get a backer, thinking that Rhino Dude is going to fast fall low. But nope, Rhino Dude a little bit smarter than that. Possible conditioning going on here, and hopefully Rhino Dude can actually see through it. There's a quick down air there, and able to get the up B as Charlie tries to recover back from it. There's another up air straight to the platform. Gonna be doing a lot of these on. Um, these charge shot cancels here in the air, just trying to mix up his landings. Trying to pause himself in the air. Ooh, great shot there. He gets about three quarters of a charge there. Quick down smash, not gonna be quick enough there. Forward air into the back air. Nair into needles, into bouncing fish. The tried and true. Charlie the King Sheik looking pretty warmed up here. Down throw, trying to get the trying to get the up air there. Not the percentage for that to work. There's the up B, not gonna do it this time. Maybe with a little bit more rage, that actually work. Oops, might be sorry about that. A little further. At the end of again, the double jump there, so he couldn't extend the combo any further. There's the down air, not gonna kill just yet. Trying to get the drag down up air. Hopefully continue that combo a little bit later. Oh, up throw? Yep, up throw is going to do it. Samus does have a kill throw now. In the form of up throw. Another three quarter shot there. Charlie's just going to eat it. Another shield. There's the landing there into the forward air. Just going to continue all that damage, but there's another up B to stop Charlie the King's uh, momentum. And we'll see what Rhino Dude can do with all this stage control. Forward smash, not gonna do it. Rhino Dude looking like he's in desperation mode with that. Or potentially meant he forward tilt, probably got too excited on the stick. Ooh! Needles to up smash. Definitely been practicing that. No hesitation there. And forward into the backer there, and now forcing Rhino Dude into the corner. Rhino Dude not wasting any time with that charge shot. Just going to fire it. Oh. Okay. Hey, man, we got All right. Um, 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 not going to be switching over to the player cam, for the battery has just died. <laughs> Oops. I didn't keep an eye on the battery. Uh, we're going to be waiting until after this set to change it. So enjoy the gameplay for now. Should have checked it before going on break. Oopsies. Game two. I'm gonna do it anyway, just to flex the new transitions. Anyway, switching over to the Dark Samus. Quinn with the backer, double forward tilt, trying to get trying to get the forward airs going, I guess. He just missed it. Quick little forward air into the bouncing fish. Not really gonna do it that much. Ooh, great carry there. Did he even have to do it, but he did it anyway. A couple of slower homing laser lasers, missiles. Excuse me. Up B out of shield, just gonna launch him way out there, and there is the back here, and that's going to take the first stock. Rhino Dude with a full head of steam here on his counter pick here at Smashville. Quick charge shot there, easy 27% of damage, trying to get the up B out of shield, getting a little bit too antsy with that. Perhaps a little bit of fear coming here from Rhino Dude. Another charge shot there into the Florida, thought he was gonna jump out of shield. Not really going to be doing much there. A couple more nares into the needles into the bouncing fish, and that will do it. Landing there. A couple of
couple floaters, trying to get the backer, trying to extend that as much as he can. Great tech there from Rhino Dude, actually avoiding any further damage. Oh, another charge shot, just gonna eat it on the shield. A couple more landing mares, just trying to continue something. There's a down throw, fair. Trying to get the back, trying to get the backer there. Thought he was gonna jump, not really gonna do it. Landing there, not really gonna do it. There's the needles. Just gonna attack a little bit of damage. Quick little, quick little dash in and out. Just trying to get a reaction out of Rhino Dude. Another charge shot there. Charlie nodding his head. Another up the out of shield. Lots and lots of damage here. Another charge shot. Smash not gonna do it. Another back here there on the shield. Not really, still not gonna do it. Wasn't Charlie to the corner. Not Charlie fighting back. Ooh, up throw, not enough. Another, another up tilt there at the ledge. Rhino dude going for that a little bit too much. The needles into the up smash, not gonna connect. But that drag down up air into the up smash there on the platform, that is definitely going to connect. Rhino dude down. Uh, final stock, there's the up tilt there, and that's gonna do it, Charlie. Taking his hands with the controller, wiping him on his shirt. Possible a little bit of frustration there. There's the charge shot to the grab, to the forwarder. Not really gonna get much else out of there. Rhino dude trying to think a little bit too far ahead and gets hit for it. Another up B there. A quarter charge shot. Not gonna do much. Fair, fair, bouncing fish, quick damage. Another three quarter, three quarter charge shot. Not really gonna hit just yet. A couple more mirrors there. Rhino dude just having a really hard time landing, and a lot of his options are just out of fear. Not really from reads. Ooh, okay. Little bomb stopping the bouncing fish. All right. Ooh, great charge shot. Ooh. <laughs> Held on to the ledge a little bit too long as we're going into game three here in winner's quarters. He's been going for that up tilt at the ledge this entire set and it finally connects when it matters. He's back against the wall. Let's see what Charlie's counter break is gonna be. Pokemon Stadium is a pretty good choice. I think you heard me. Uh-oh. I'm going to scoot a little bit more to my left and try to avoid any sort of unintentional uh, coaching as he switched over to the wolf. I actually didn't notice that. All right, so now the gloves are off. out of shield, all that quick damage there coming up from Rhino Dude, quick forward tilt to force him there at the ledge, but another up B out of shield as he gets back. Dash attack into the up air for some quick damage, trying to get the dash attack there at the ledge to force him out. Just a little bit more Rhino Dude overextending a little bit too much, force himself to the corner. Smash there at the ledge, catching the neutral getup. That's gonna be a quick stock there coming up with Charlie the King. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We've seen Charlie combos with Wolf. This is actually pretty scary. Yep, there it is. Forward air into the Wolf Flash. Now Smash trying to catch the Wolf. Final two once again just forced over here at the ledge. Not many options he can do here. Roll into the short hop back there, the up tilt not going to connect this time. Quick little nair, couple more blasters just to try and stop any sort of jumps. Great parry into the up smash, catching the nair there. Now Charlie, three stocks, to Rhino Dude's one. A lot of these ledge options aren't really working here for Rhino Dude. Another panic up the out of shield. 
Oh, and that's going to do it. The forward air into the wolf flash, and that is going to do it. Charlie the King taking it 2-1. Here in winner's quarters, moving on to winner's semis. I am going to, I'm going to do wolf just for the sake of that. The rhino dude using semis. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. Um, I gotta change out the camera battery. So I will be right back. 